All right, so welcome back. Today in this video, we're gonna be continuing our review in water resources and environmental engineering. And the topic specifically for today is going to be stormwater. So I have a few practice problems for you all and I wanna dive right in. Okay, so a lake is evaporating Determine the lake evaporation if the pan evaporation is 8 millimeters per day and the pan coefficient is common. Okay. So, what information are we given? Well, we are given that we're given the pan evaporation. And we are given the pan coefficient, it's comma. Comma. Pretty much it. And the like it's evaporating, right? Okay. Find. All right, what are we trying to find? The lake evaporation. Okay. So I'm just going to search. I don't know what the heck is going on. So I'm just going to search lake evaporation. Okay. One thing comes up. Cool. So I go look at this, the lake evaporation EL is related to the pan evaporation by the expression, okay? So EL is equal to PC, and what is PC? Pan coefficient ranges from 0 0.3 to 0 0.85, common is 0 0.7. So, okay, we know PC, we know it's common, right? Which is 0 0.7, and then EP, what is EP? EP is the pan evaporation. So do we have the pan evaporation? Yes, at eight millimeters per day. So we are going to say, formula needed, EL is equal to PC times EP. PC, uh, what's the value of PC? Well, it's equal to 0 0.7. And then what's the value of EP? The EP is going to be eight millimeters per day. All right, so now we're just gonna multiply these out. So you get 0 0.7. Lake, ev lake evaporation is equal to 0 0.7 times eight millimeters per day. And so when you do that, I get my lake evaporation to be 5.6 millimeters per day for C. All right. Hey everybody. I know I didn't take time to formally introduce myself at the beginning. So I did want to let you know who I am and how I can best serve you as you're studying for your civil FE exam. So my name is James Huntley and I am a civil engineer who has helped hundreds of individuals pass and dominate their civil FE exam. Now I know this test is tough and as you're going through material, you may be saying, uh, I don't remember learning this stuff or gosh, these variables are so confusing or you just feel like you're really, really busy and there's so much material that you need to go through that it's a bit overwhelming. So I did want to let you know that I do help and work with individuals one on one to ensure that they pass their civil FE exam. And I've had individuals that have worked with me for 10 weeks, and that's the longest that it has been. And I've had individuals that have worked with me for two weeks, 
and we went back to back day after day after day hours on hours on hours putting in the work um, working together to ensure that they went ahead and passed right and this exam is so important because i know that you want to make more money um, i know that you want to you know get some promotions and be able to further your career and have your pe so definitely want to open and extend a hand out want to be able to save you time right because i know some people that watch my videos you may have been watching my videos for six nine even 12 months and you still haven't passed your civil fe exam and that is the one thing that's keeping you from making more income more impact and furthering your career. So it's definitely costing you um, money, resources, everything. So looking to create more success stories, um, I am looking to work with individuals one-on-one. -on -one. I wanna hop on Zoom with you. I want you to share what you're doing as you're solving these problems so I can spot out what you may be struggling with and open your eyes so that you're not going into this test completely blind now for some of you you may have failed a test once twice had some people fail five times um, or you may be wanting to take this test initially and you just want to make sure that you pass it up front so do have one-on-one -on -one services i also have some uh, do-it-yourself uh, courses that if you're like no i got this i got it all on my own I know everything or I, I'm going to take the time to study everything. I do have some resources and materials to be able to help you in that way. But my biggest fear is that you're investing in something, uh, these programs or these courses, and you know, you're not uh, getting back or having proper feedback to help you and to push you forward. You're just giving a bunch of information and no one's sharing with you what you may be actually struggling with or what's keeping you from passing your FE exam. So looking to create a ton of success stories. So feel free um, down in the description box below. I have a ton of resources, including one on one coaching. Let's hop on a call. Uh, it's no cost to you as far as, you know, us talking through your goals and what you're trying to do um, and kind of getting a feel for where you're at. Um, so have some programs where I can work with you one on one. And there's also some do it yourself courses, practice exams, study guides, resources, free material, all of that down in the description box below. So feel free to check out that stuff. If you like the video, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. This is what I do. Um, we want to get you to the next phase of your civil engineering career um, and leave a comment. If you had any questions about um, what I went through, the information that I covered um, and feel free to um, definitely schedule a call with me and I'm looking forward to creating more success stories. So. Be sure to check out this next video 